no, 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 Ayala, brother. French Montana. Drop that pussy, bitch. Put out a video of a song that him and Drake just recorded. Drake, I ain't trying to yeah. All about the mood, all about the mood. Word to the bird, I ain't never take a first shot. Yeah. Pump, pump, pump it up. And put in the Instagram, this song may or may not end Joe Budden's career. And then you hear Drake in the background repeating the words. Pump, pump, pump it up. To pump it up, which was pretty much Joe Budden's biggest song. Oh, it's just too good. <laughs> this is, of course, in the response to Joe Budden's podcast last week. I think that that kid on that album that I heard sounds real fucking uninspired. You can't fool a real nigga. You can fool them. Joe Budden has since taken to Instagram since we first reported on this story. 16, there's no reason for any artist to start a verse with pump, pump it up. Well, pump Other it up. than I got something to say to you know who. Coming off the, the most listened to podcast of the week. Him screaming him passionately. Him screaming passionately <laughs> about pushing the agenda and this, that. You know, the love that he has for Drake. We know what it is. Uh, yeah, that's, nigga, it's a verse coming. It's a verse coming. Y'all are so narrow-minded. Why pump it up is dope, though. He missed what we saying. I mean, nobody's not saying it's not dope. But he, I know. I'm saying a nigga could just be like, just see. <laughs> see. My question is this, so Drake, Aubrey, you making us biracials look bad, man? Ooh, nigga. How come you can go at Joe Buttons and Meek Mill, but you can't say anything to Jay Z and Kendrick Lamar? Just you know, I was a little intimidated and overwhelmed. Making us biracials look bad, man. I don't know. And I kind of think that uh, Joe Budden versus Drake would be a pretty dope battle because uh, Joe Budden ain't no slouch on the microphone. And I'm sure Joe Budden would have some bars for that ass for sure. 